Welcome to Al May. We are here to share tech knowledge with you. Let's get our journey started. Today, we are going to talk about how to move system reserved partition to another drive. We have two parts in this video. Part one: Move system reserved partition with disk management. Part two: Move system reserved partition without my backupper. System reserved partition contains Windows boot files, so your computer will not boot if this partition is missing. To avoid this situation, you need to move system reserved partition to another drive. Generally speaking, moving system reserved partition in Windows 10, 8, and 7 is dangerous because it may cause system failure. Please create a system backup or disk backup just in case. Then pick one method below and follow its steps to move system reserved partition to another drive. With further ado, let's get started with the first method. The first method is to use building disk management to move boot partition on wrong drive. Please note that the following operation may cause unexpected problems. Thus, you need to create a repair disk first. Once your computer cannot boot successfully, you can use it to troubleshoot the computer. Let's start. To get into disk management, we type Windows at R and input diskmgmt.msc in the pop-up window and click OK. Here you can see all your disks and their information. Now you can see we have a system reserved partition on disk 1. Create a new simple partition on disk 0. Please note that the system reserved partition is 100 MB on Windows 7, 350 MB on Windows 8, and 500 MB on Windows 10. We are using Windows 10 here, so we create a 500 MB partition. If you do not have an unallocated space on disk 0, you can shrink partition first. Right-click the unallocated space and choose New Simple Volume. Assign a drive letter for your newly simple partition, for example, Z. Copy everything from the system reserved partition to your newly simple partition Z. Remove the drive letter from system reserved partition on disk 1. Set the new partition as system reserved. Remove the drive letter of your new system reserved partition. Then mark it as active. Restart your computer and delete system reserved partition on disk 1. Now you have successfully moved it. You know using disk management may cause unexpected problems. A more serious situation is that your computer cannot boot. Why not try an easier and safer way to complete the task? Here you will learn the easiest solution to move system reserved partition in Windows 10, 8, and 7. It will clone all the boot drives, including the system reserved partition, and move it to a second drive. Meanwhile, it could ensure secure boot after cloning by setting the active system reserved partition as primary partition and avoid unwanted deletion. Just Google Ami Backupper, download, and install it. Here comes the second method in part 2. Now take Windows 10 as an example. Before we start, you should prepare an external hard drive and be sure it can be detected. If you don't have extra disk, you can create an unallocated space on the disk 
containing system reserved partition to install the system partition. It is around 500 megabytes in Windows 10. Let's start to learn how to move system reserved partition in Windows 10 with system clone feature in Alme Backupper. Click Alme Backupper to get into its interface. Here you can see the options on the left menu. Select Clone and System Clone. Then it will automatically select the operating system and system reserved partition. Select the external hard drive or unallocated space as destination path and click Next. Then click Start Clone to perform Windows 10 Move System Reserved Partition. Just wait for a while. When it finished, boot computer from the clone drive and delete the previous system reserved partition to free disk space. Till now, you have successfully completed the task. System reserved partition is very important for computer users to start Windows. So please be sure it's on the desk with Windows installed. It's suggested to keep Ami Backupper on your computer to protect your data and system by its powerful features. That is all about how to move system reserved partition to another drive. Hope you can get what you need after watching this video. Want to know more about Alme? Looking for more tech knowledge? Just subscribe us and leave comments. We are here to help you with any questions.